Hello, and this video is week 33. I can't believe things are going that quickly on my uh, rebooted weight loss journey. So this is the update video for this week, what I've been doing last week, what I'm planning on doing on the week going forward. And I hope you enjoy. My name is Mark and I'm here to help you live a better, healthier life. My goal is to help as many people as I can get into shape and improve their quality of life. Now, if this is your first time here and you want to learn more about practical and effective ways to improve your health, your overall wellness, or if you're just interested in expanding your knowledge about fitness and nutrition, start now by hitting the subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss any of our videos going forward. And now, without further ado, let's jump right in. So accountability. In this last week, it's been a week of uh, ups and downs. I'm enjoying the, the new PT sessions and I'm enjoying going back to the gym. Um, one of the things that hasn't gone so well this week is uh, the kind of walks with the dogs, just because uh, our eldest dog is injured again. Um, so those have been a little bit shorter than I would have liked over the last three or four days. In terms of the exercise in the house, that's still going on, I'm still doing the little circuits that the uh, the PT has put me onto. Um, so doing those as well. So exercise has kind of gone up a little bit, but I'd hoped it had gone up a bit more with those long walks with the dogs. I'm finding that I need to get out even earlier than before, just so it's a little bit cooler in the mornings. Uh, although I did get caught out in a torrential rainstorm one morning with the dogs and came back absolutely soaked to the skin. But the dogs seem to enjoy themselves, so I suppose that's the uh, that's the main thing there, isn't it? So in terms of uh, this week, the the exercise is going quite well. The bit I'm struggling with at the minute, and I need to be honest, the, the bit I'm struggling with at the minute is is the new diet. Um, I'm having, I am in the process of increasing the number of calories I'm having. Uh, I'm eating uh, far more protein than I'm used to, um, and I feel like I'm eating. It feels like most of the time, to be brutally honest. Uh, I'm still under 2,000 calories, um, and I need to increase that to 2,100 calories. But I'm actually finding it a little bit of a struggle to, to eat that much. Um, but as the PT pointed out, um, you know, my body's got used to where it is. I need to shake it up a little bit in order to get things moving again. So off we go. You know, lots of protein, um, lots of chicken. It feel, it does feel like I'm just eating chicken most of the time. But we've got to give it a go. This is only the second complete week of doing this. So I said we'd give it a, a kind of experiment for a month, see how things go. Um, I am enjoying the gym. I am enjoying the fact that the weights are slowly going back up again. And it's really quite nice. So. Exercise going well, but not as well as it um, as I'd like it to be going. And in terms of the diet, we are getting there, but I am struggling with the uh, the volume of protein uh, that I'm eating. Just the volume in general. I'm not used to that uh, level of meat eating. But all is going quite well, and we'll see how we uh, progress. I think I've got another week or two before uh, uh, I actually get measured up and everything else again, and we'll we'll have a review of how far we've gone. So the week ahead, I've really got two focuses in this week ahead. More water, I'm somewhere around the two and a half liters uh, per day with the water, so I need to increase that a little bit uh, and make it consistent. Um, so definitely, and apparently tea and coffee don't count. That is purely drinking actual water. So need to increase that a little bit. I've got a handy flask uh, that I use, which is about 500 milliliters. So it's quite easy to track how much you're having through the day. And I would recommend something along those lines to anybody who's trying to drink you know, more water um, in their fitness uh, journey, purely for the fact that it's quite hard to track if you're just having glasses here and there. Whereas if you've got some sort of bottle, um, even an, a, an empty bottle that you fill up with water and put in the fridge so you've got nice ice cold water, um, then that works too. But try and track it. I need to increase mine a little bit. So I'm working on that this week, and I need to increase my calories uh, by about another 200 calories per day uh, to get in target with the, the, the trainer set sort of minimum 2,100 uh, calories. So working on both those things this week, uh, I've bought um, a whole 
pile of uh, lean chicken and things to, to just cook up in batches. So I've always got uh, protein to, to go and munch on. Um, and yeah, that's kind of where we are at the moment uh, in terms of the week ahead. Um, as soon as the dogs are a little bit better, we'll do longer walks. So we're still doing three or four kilometers, but we're not doing the four to seven kilometers that we would normally do. So just a little bit shorter. Um, so I'm looking forward to getting back to that. Um, I'm still doing the exercise that the PT set um, and really focusing on water and my diet this week and see how we get on uh, with, uh, with the end of week three next week. I'll keep you posted on how we're going on. And as always, if you've enjoyed this video, please do hit a like. It helps get the videos out there and hopefully, hopefully help other people too. And I will speak to you in the next video.